This is a quick demonstration on how to stake up a tree. Um, first thing you want to do is, is get some stakes, some good stakes. These are good high quality stakes here. They're about seven feet long. What we've done here is we've pounded them into the ground on a little bit of an angle. You want to get them at an angle, you don't want to be straight up. You have them on an angle here. You want to get them equidistant around the tree. Um, so we got our stakes done. I've already tied up two, but I'm going to give you a quick demonstration on uh, how to get a good tying uh, knot on string so that uh, as the tree grows, you can, you can uh, work to tighten these uh, ropes up in time as the tree um, matures a little bit. So in any case, you got the stake here. So first thing you want to do is you want to get a piece of, of hose. We've cut it just enough to get around this tree right here and come back. Uh, you don't want it to be too short. The big thing, the reason you use these hoses, you don't want this rope right here cutting into the cambium, this outer layer of the tree. So what right here, we have the, the hose on here. We've, uh, we've taken some good, uh, this is uh, just a polyester braided, triple braided rope. Uh, it's gonna weather good. You wanna keep these stakes on for about a year until the tree establishes. That's the big big reason you stake these up is uh, if these stakes weren't, weren't here with this tree, you get a good gust of wind, it knocked the tree right over. So we wanna get the root ball and the roots to establish a little bit. So here we are, just got this, uh, this nylon string kinda going through the hose here. Um, I prefer black hose. I think it looks a little bit better aesthetically than the green hose. Uh, but in any case, we're just going to do a quick knot here. Nothing really special over and under. Go through here, tie it, do a little bit of a slip knot. Under, under, tie up like that. Tighten it up, pull. That's not going anywhere. So that's what we got there. Next thing we do is you want to grab the string right here with your finger. Twist it a little bit. Take this other piece and kind of go under. And what we're doing is we're just kind of keeping, we'll, let me start over again, twist it, go under. You want to pull this little piece here, tighten it up like that. And this is going to allow us to create a little bit of a, a pulley tension, tension system, if you will. Next thing I know, you can see this isn't going anywhere. Just a nice little slip. Wrap it around the stake right here. Come back in here, go under through that little knot. And what this allows, again, tension, create it like that. You can see how the tree's moving a little bit. And what we wanna do is all these other things, these are tight, relatively tight. So good pressure from all angles of the tree. Pretty easy right here, you just pull it. Then what you wanna do is you wanna take this end string, go under, just like so, through here. Get that tension, hold it under. Again, go under. Take this back through. This little piece right here, so just like so. Just the piece that was under and over, and just pull it back. There you go with that. You can see there's good tension here. And the good thing that's, that's good about this knot is you can undo it, tension's gone. So if you need to start over, just come back again under. Pull it like this, just like so. Hold it for the tension right there. Take this piece, take this little thing through here, this little dog ear, get a little enough, get enough of it you can pull, pull it back away from you, nice and tight. And uh, that's the way to get good tension on strings in the tree. And uh, there's a little lesson for you there, thanks.